is he for real? Or do you think if it's some very clear defeat for him that he plays the martyr and, you know, packs up his twiddly winks and goes home? I believe that in his heart, he is a coward. Uh, uh, This is not a man of great courage. Uh, I think he's a phony. I think he's looking for a fig leaf. Uh, I believe he thinks he's going to lose and he wants to have an excuse because he doesn't want to confront that he is going to be rejected by the American people. So I do not believe now, having said that, all things are possible with this guy. Um, You know, Nicole, and, and let me just take one minute here. Because I had calmed down, okay? I, I had a couple of hours this morning. I drank some chamomile tea. I did a little meditation. <laughs> I calmed down. And then I heard what he said. I don't know who the Proud Boys are. Now, it was the, the story coming out of the debate. It is all they were talking about in the White House this morning. It is all they were talking about on his network, Fox News. For him to stand there and not reject the ideology of the Proud Boys, the hate, the white supremacy, the misogyny, the anti-Semitism, for him to not reject that, instead lie and say, I don't know who the Proud Boys are. How stupid does he think we are? And it is just infuriating. And anybody who tries to say that what he did today somehow fixes last night, no, no, no. It makes it much worse because he is not rejecting white supremacy. He is not rejecting their violence. He is not rejecting their vigilantism. He is not rejecting what they're willing to do for him if he crooks his little finger. And that is what's infuriating about this man. That's why he's going to lose. And I do think he'll go off into the distance with his tail between his legs. I'm sorry for the time you spent drinking tea and meditating, but I need you to keep going, Claire. <laughs> well, it, 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 it really is just frankly unbelievable, isn't it? How can he say, look in the camera and say, I, I, I think don't so. know who the Proud yeah. Boys are. I mean, he knows who the Proud Boys are. His staff's told him all morning. I mean, Google it. For, for goodness sake, Google it. They're a hate group. And he will not say it because he wants them. He wants them on his side. That should be enough right there to reject this man wholly and fully. Tom Friedman's right. We should be worried that this guy has gotten in the Oval Office and dirtied it up with this kind of hate. It is outrageous for our country that we all love. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.